how you landed on The Bachelor? It's actually kind of funny because I don't know how I got on The Bachelor. Somebody anonymously submitted me, and um, I had never watched the show before, so it's it's kind of funny. I had no idea what to expect, and all of a sudden, somebody from ABC is calling me, saying they want me on The Bachelor show, and I thought it was a joke, but um, obviously it wasn't. So um, I thought, why not? Why not give this a shot? This could be a great opportunity to meet someone, and uh, I'm glad I did it. I had a great time. Uh, that was actually me that submitted your photos. Yeah, you know. Awesome. Um, Megan and Shane, how did you guys get on The Amazing Race? I went down. There you go. I went down that you submitted her, her, her application. But anyways, um, Shane and I have been fans of The Amazing Race since season one. Um, I, we were teenagers, and I would watch it with my, my mom. Shane would watch it with his grandma, and we started dating right after high school. And um, we both independently loved the show. We said, we're going to try out. So we tried out for season uh, 13. They told us, we don't have enough life, life experience. And we said, yeah, that's why we're trying out for the show. And so they said, oh, I'll try again. So we tried again, um, You know, made it pretty far through the process, got down to the last 15 teams and got cut, uh, which was pretty tough. And then um, you know, the next season, we put in the application. They basically picked the whole cast. They are looking for one last couple, called me up, and they said, Megan, are you and Shane still together? I said, yes. They said, can you be in LA in two hours? I said, yes. So we went up there. Uh, a couple days later, we got our shots, and we, we took off for the race. So that's our, that's our story. Shane, did anything to add there, or are you just going to nod? Sarah, Dean, and Vincent, I, I guess it's a different story for you guys, right? Yeah, I'll tell my story a little bit. Um, I auditioned for So You Think You Can Dance Canada season one, and I got cut. Um, so I decided I need to work my butt off and train for a year. Went back second season, and somehow I won. Um, the audition process is intense. It's probably the worst time of your life. Uh, you know, there's thousands of people, and all the dancers are really strong. So yeah, it was a crazy experience, and I'm really happy I auditioned for the second time. So that's my experience. Uh, I auditioned just for season two, and I was pretty lucky, so I got it, and it was really cool. It was really hard. Well, we have to audition in our city first. For me, it was in Montreal. For you, it was in St. John, I think? Yeah. All right. And yes, I went to Montreal. There's the first step. We're going to the finals, or we're not going. So at the beginning, we're like, kind of, well, in Canada, it's a little bit smaller, but we were something like six, seven thousand auditioning, so they're just keeping 200 person and to do the final week in Toronto it's like an, an, an intense week sorry for my accent at the same time I'm French so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so uh, uh, during final week we're 200 at our, and they are eliminating people every day you need to pass to every kind of style hip-hop like me I'm a ballroom dancer and she's a contemporary dancer so you're starting with hip-hop jazz contemporary everything and they're cutting people every day, and at the end, you need to, like, you're not sleeping. Uh, they're, you're just dancing, 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 not sleeping, and after they're like, okay, well, there's just 40 left, and they're like, are you in the when you're not? You're waiting two days, and after they tell you if you're in it or not. So, yeah, that's it. We were on it last season. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. okay. Good time. Okay. <laughs> Uh, well, I uh, tried out for Pop Stars, which is uh, the Global's version that came out before Idol. Um, I had heard it was coming to town, um, and I, I auditioned. I actually auditioned. I didn't make it past the first cut for, gold, for, for Pop Stars, so I just went into Idol to give my demo out to people, um, and it just took over my whole summer. I lined up out in the cold for two days. Um, you know, couldn't shower, obviously. Ate hot dogs f for 48 hours, and it was incredible. The audition process was amazing, intense, you know, just like, I totally know what you guys went through. Very intense, I was having nightmares about it every night, and luckily Idol had a psychologist on hand, you know. <laughs> I can't even hear the theme music of Idol, of any Idol anymore, and my heart just starts to beat, it's, it was that intense. Um, and I passed 12 rounds, and uh, finally was eliminated in the top 10. Amazing experience, really opened a lot of doors for me. And uh, unfortunately, the show no longer is running, but it might be coming back. I don't know. I, I don't have the inside scoop, so, so that's my story. Thank you.